Good everyone. My name is Graphics. In this video, we want to solve the problem that is displayed at the right hand side of the screen. And the question goes like this it says, Figure 3 shows three views of a block. Make a free hand sketch of the isometric views of the block, making X the lowest point. Now if you look closely, we have three given views. We have the front elevation, we have the plan, and we have the end elevation. So this is first angle projection. Now we are told to transform or we are told to change these given views into isometric. But in this case, we are going to be using our freehand to do that that is we are not using our ruler we are not using any other thing aside from our pencil right so the first thing you have to do you need to draw out your box right now the question is how will i draw my box now you pay attention now you're going to draw your vertical line this way you draw your vertical line this way You use faint line first. Can you see that? And you draw your z axis and you draw your x axis. You can see that. Now, the next thing you do, you take this up and you take this up too. Can you see that? You do the same thing here too your z axis and you do the same thing here to your x axis right let me bring this down a little bit so you see what i'm trying to say here so aside that do the same thing here too can you see that so once you've done that this is the first step with your faint line now if you look, we'll start from the front elevation and we are told that we should use X as our lowest point. You see where the X is, meaning that the front elevation will be facing this side. So this is X, so our X point will be here. If I'm drawing that, so let's draw what we see there. I'm having this point this way. First of all, I have my line this way. This line, my arrow is pointing. Right? Second of all, I am having this faint line, your hidden line at this side. So hidden line means that the dry, the line will not show at this direction here. That's why I'm having the line. The hidden line is in the other side, not this side. So I will not draw the hidden line. Now the next thing is, I have this this way. I'll draw it out. Faint line. Whatever you're doing, use a faint line. And I have this this way too. And this is coming this way. And I'm stopping here. All right, this is what I have. Now aside that, right, I can virtually look from the plan that this line you're seeing here is this point you're seeing here. So meaning that this part you're seeing is inclined. So let's do that. So from here, I'll draw a line that will move from this end to touch here. I'll draw another line that will move from this end to touch here. Then this one is going backward also. So this is coming here to touch here. Right? Uh, we have this coming this way. This is coming to touch here. Then this is coming down. Coming down. This is coming this way, right? So this is coming down. This is coming this way, right? So if you look from the top now, that is this side you're seeing here. Is all we have there because we are told that is the x. So x is here. So that means facing this side. Then if you look at the end elevation, we have 
something coming here this way because he said this x is here so I'll place it this way can you see that so this hidden line it's mean that something is true that is what you are saying in front from the front television then from the plan to also have the same thing so i can now take in this one out this way Cannot take this one out this way. Cannot take it out this way. Taking that this way, and I'm taking that this way. This is what we have. This is how you can transform what is at the right hand side to this. So let's con let's confirm and see what will happen. This is our front elevation here, right? That is talking about here. You see all these points here. From here to here is from here to here. From here to here is from here to here. The hidden line you are seeing here is that hidden line you are seeing. Looking from this side, there's something moving along the other side. Is that okay now? Then this line you're seeing here is this you're seeing here. Now this shape you're seeing is this shape you're seeing. So if you're seeing this inclined line as a straight line from our father, like I explained from my previous videos, is that okay now? Now aside that this is what we have looking for from television. Now let's look from the plan. If you look from the plan, right, if you're seeing this this way, this inclined line, you're seeing it as a straight line from here to here, is this you have here, right? Then this line you're seeing. And this line you will be seen as if these two points is on the same level as from here to here that's why you are having it to be what a straight line is that again so from this point you're saying from this point to this point is from this point straight down to this point here is that again then all this side that is free here all this side here from here all this true is what you are seeing at all this point here from the plan looking from the top now this step you're seeing here is here you're seeing and this step you are seeing here is here that you are seeing. Is that okay now? So that is from the plan. So if I want to help you out, I will say that. Just look what I'm doing from the plan. This is A, right? Then all this side you are seeing here is B, as you can see. This side you are seeing here is C. Here is what is G. That's what you are seeing here. You can see the way I'm putting them systematically here, right? Even from the front television. This side you're seeing here, this is A. You're seeing A both at the front elevation at the plan, right? And uh, you'll be seeing E here. This is E. Let me call it E looking at it from this side. Is that okay now? Then this side here, this will be what? Our F here. So looking at it from this side. Is that okay now? You'll be seeing A, E, F. Looking from the top, you're going to see A, D, C, B. All together. Now when you're looking from the end elevation, which is from this side here, you will be seeing G, this is G here, all these points you're seeing here is G. Then this side you're seeing here is H, so you'll be seeing that side, right? That is from here to here, it's from here to here, and that is H. Then here is I, right? And this point you're seeing here is I. Then here is J, let me call it J. And this point you're seeing here is what is J. So you'll be seeing all those points here, right? This is what we'll talk. This is how you can transform that figure, and you must use your free and sketch, no ruler, no pencil. So this is the point X you're seeing. So this X you're seeing is that X you're seeing here. So this is the lowest point of our given figure here. So if you have actually this uh, found this video helpful, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and also share the video. Thanks for watching.